What's going on everybody? This is Al from PlayboyGamer.com And in the last Dynasty video, we took on Florida State. We ended up getting beat by 12. It was a great game all the way up to the fourth quarter and we just pooped the bed in the end. They played a whole lot better than we did. Their talent uh, took care of the rest and we ended up getting a loss. So we're four and four on the season and today we are hosting five and three Wake Forest. It's gonna be another tough one. They got more talent than we do. They're not going to be as talented as Florida State, so maybe we got a chance there, but we're going to have to play a whole lot better. Now, if I'm not mistaken, they run a, kind of like a spread offense and a 3-4 defense, if I'm not mistaken. But the day is even more important due to recruiting. We got several guys coming in today. Now, Philip Warren, the tackle, he has already came in. He's still a soft verbal, but we need to win a game to convince him to come, apparently. Now, Rob Harper, the free safety, is coming today. We need to figure out what he likes. Let's see, coaching career. So that's coaching style, then uh, style of play. That's coaching style and then prestige. I'm sorry, so prestige and coaching style. Academics and then uh, location. So it's either gonna be program prestige or playing time. We're gonna take the chance and go playing time for that one. Program prestige isn't gonna help us because our program procedures are very good. Now we know what this guy likes, but he's not coming in to visit today, unfortunately. So let's go on to Kobe Lacey. He is visiting today, the center out of Tennessee. And let's see, location, academics, playing time, and coach philosophy. So it's one of the prestigious. We're gonna go with program prestige for that one. So hope for the best, make sure you stay to the end of the video. And we'll see if we can get at least one commitment. It'd be nice, but we gotta win. Bowl rankings, top 25 polls, and a Heisman watch. None of that pertains to us whatsoever, but there's the Heisman watch at least. You go to Players of the Week. We can check and see who made National Player of the Week last week. It was a wide receiver out of UAB and a defensive end out of Toledo. Had some really good games. Then you go to the Arrow Conference. Looks like it was a Virginia sweep, both a quarterback and that middle linebacker. Now let's go to Conference Standings. Here we are in the conference. Now we're way behind. Well, we're not way behind. We're a game behind. But we are behind Miami technically by two. So we're not going to win the conference or the division this year. That's, that's not going to happen unless we get super lucky. But here we are in the... I'm, I'm sorry. Let's look at this. Yes, yeah, so Miami's ahead of us. They're going to need to lose two games or we're going to need to win out more or less for that to happen. But we check out our team info screen. It's pretty much the same info over and over again. Drummer and Boyle keep going back and forth in rushing but everything else is kind of the same now we are taking on my goodness i already forgot who we're going to play against let's go wake force that's who it is yes wake force we'll check out their team info screen strong safety guard and wide receiver hopefully all these are starters that should help us today they look at their quarterbacks having a really good season they got a running back is putting up really good numbers they got one uh, linebacker apparently it's got 52 tackles which is really good halfway through the season well, I guess we're already over halfway through. And their last game, they beat NC State. Okay, let's go ahead and take on the Demon Deacons. We'll see if we have anybody in trouble. And we do not. Now, we are going to stick with our home, quote-unquote, home uniform. Hopefully, we can win a game with these. All right, let's get into it. And it looks like we got another rainy game in Durham, North Carolina. Most of our home games have been rain games for whatever reason. Today's super important. We got to win for recruiting's sake, just to make things a whole lot better. And we're two games out from going to a bowl game. So let's try our best and win today. I've got to play a whole lot better than we did against Florida State. We played okay against Florida State, but not good enough, apparently. I'm assuming they're going to predict Wake Forest to win. It's been a long time since I played the Demon Deacons. It's been a long time since I played in the ACC period. But they're going to highlight a running back. That's nice to know. I'm guessing he is an impact player. And they are picking the Demon Deacons, as expected. All right, let's go to the coin toss. They won it, and they will kick it off first, because we're going to get the ball first. Let's go to their roster, see what we're dealing with. Starting quarterback, 74 speed, hit the backup as Zach same player. 
they can run just enough. I'm going to go after them when needed. Halfback, impact guy, 94 overall. This guy's going to give us some trouble today. Fullback, pretty good, 85. Look at the receivers, 84, 82. They got the number two guys out. But a really solid core. Why is this guy number five? I don't know. That's just, I need to rearrange these next dynasty I start up. I already went ahead and done that, by the way. Somebody reminded me of doing that. So in our next dynasty, Morton was going to be the number one guy on the list, on the depth chart. Tight end, 84. Then you look at their tackle. Well, let's look at their tight end again. 72 speed, and he can catch, so they're going to throw it to him probably a time or two. Look at their offensive line, 84. Left guard is out. Bit of a drop-off there. Then 86, 80, and 88. So their offensive line is really solid. you got to remember, Wake Forest won the ACC title the year after this, if I'm not mistaken. Now, they run a 3-4 defense, I think. 84 and 82 on the ends, and their defensive tackle. 84, 78. I could be wrong. They may be running a 4-3, but I think they do run a 3-4. You got 80, then you got 85 at middle linebacker. 70 behind him, right outside linebacker, 82. So their front seven's okay. Corners, 82 and 78. Maybe we can exploit that. Of course, our wide receiver core is just not very good. They got a really good free safety. A really good strong safety, but he's out today. But his backup isn't terrible by any means. Then you got an average kicker, a really strong punter. And that is it. So let's go ahead and let's get this show on the road. Hopefully we can play well and get a win. I will probably keep this one in the end zone. I'm going to go ahead and switch this one. It's on my mind. We're going to go right here. We're in the middle of the field, so let's try deep cross up. Now, they got two decent safeties, so we can keep it as is. I got plenty of time to throw. Good defense, and just like that, and I'm, I'm frozen. I don't know what the deal is. I don't know if it showed, but it's, my game is slowing down on me, and I don't know why. Well, just like that, they perfect defense on their parts. Just not a very good pass at all by Schneider. Just par for the course. I should be used to it by now. He's just not a very good quarterback. I hope he's not an impact guy next year. I'm sure he will be. It's a good stop there. Going back to a bigger set. I'm going to stay in man a lot today. I'm going to try to keep this running back down as best I can. Probably leave that as is. Somebody get a stop. There you go. So it's third and long, but a flag. Hopefully that's coming back. I may decline this. Third and 12 or 12 and 21? Or second and 12 and 21? We're going to go third and 12. I'm going to decline that. That may be a mistake, but I think I'm okay with that decision. I don't want to get them, have them an easier third down situation later. We need to get a stop here. And that's a touchdown, I swear. I just, what do you do? Off to an amazing start. Just can't do anything right for whatever reason. It is what it is. We're just not a very good team. Let's try to get bounce back. Try not to turn the ball over. I'm scared to death to throw the ball. It's getting to the point where my impact quarterback just can't make hardly any throw. Hopefully my game doesn't slow down on me again like it did. And just like that, we're in the hole. Let's see if we can do something here. We're on the right hash. We got a guy hurt. Let's do a toss with Drummer. We're going man dime. Now I feel the need to run clock going forward. Get a first down there. Let's do a basic run with Boyle. The clock is stopped. Zone nickel. 
good defense, just nothing there. They blitz right to the spot where I was supposed to run. Nothing you can do about that. Let's go back to cross up. I'm not exactly in the middle of the field, but I'm close enough. Maybe he can make a better throw this time. I'm going to run clock, just in our best interest, too. I just don't trust our offense to... I don't trust our defense to keep stopping them. Get it down to a couple of seconds. Much better throw. Good job, Schneider. And a... Okay, that's still our ball. On the right hash. Let's pick a off tackle play with Dargan. Zone 4 3. The clock has stopped. Not a big fan of that shift. Get about four yards there. Let's go direct with Boyle. They're blitzing that right nickel. We don't need a high snap here by any means. The clock is stopped, so we'll go ahead and snap it. Perfect defense, of course. Left tackle blew it. So guess what? Third and long. Let's try deep cross up again. I hate to use the same play over and over again, but we're in the middle of the field a ton, and this play can work if it's executed correctly. So the clock is going. We'll let it do so. I can't kick a field goal if this doesn't work. It's, we're too far out and our kicker isn't good enough. Good protection there. Almost fumbled it again. So good play, good throw by Schneider. Let's go full back over. We're going zone, so I'm gonna leave that receiver over there. We're gonna let that clock roll. I hate that we lost the possession in that first one, but there's nothing you can do about it. Hopefully we get decent blocking here. Nope. We're very fortunate he didn't fumble it there. Let's put in ace normal. Let's put in our tight ends on this one. Let's go half back direct. I know they're still going goal line. I'm going to bring this other tight end over. The clock is running, so we're going to let it do so. We just can't. we got to avoid mistakes. There we go. Six points. So we're going to tie it up. Glad we brought the tight end over. Get an extra blocker. Let's get back on defense. Try not to give up another touchdown. And he tacks on the extra point. Here's the drive we took off over two minutes. I'm all up for that. They don't have any impact guys on the back end. So we will kick out like normal, but this is going over here. And he's definitely going to return this one. Good tackle right there by 28, whoever you are. Let's go back to man. Going ace twins. I know they got a lot of 12 personnel sets. Man, I don't know what that's fair. That's just my fault. I should have made the tackle. Something keeps flashing on my screen. I don't know, my OBS is something ain't working. That's what I use to capture everything is OBS. Nine times out of ten, it does a great job. Going for a pass. Good tackle there. Only gets a couple. I'm a still staying man. I don't want this running back to run all over me all day. Otherwise, we won't have a chance. Off tackle. Face mask. I swear. Huh. We get like three of those a, a week. That's a five yard. It's going to be second or we're going to make it first and ten. Uh, 
Let's keep playing some more defense. Play action. Get him, get him, get him. Or just fr fumble. Somebody pick it up. Huge play. Man. Man, we needed that. We got to take advantage of this. So they got a turnover. We got a turnover. What I want to do, is he still okay? He is. We're going to go with the wide receiver option play, but they're going zone. I wish they would have went man, but that's okay. Wow, perfect defense. Look at this. Our right tackle just decided he went after, I don't know what he was doing there. Just bad luck, I swear. Oh, second and 14. Let's try tight end delay. They're going man, but they're going dime. They're doing that. We're going to do something like this. We'll go to somebody on the left. I'm going to have Wright do that just so he stays away from Elliot. So R1 or square. Cover zero. Let's go, Elliot. Make a play. We're awful. It just it is what it is. There's nothing you can do about it. We're just not very good. Tight end cross. Hopefully we don't throw an interception here. We're going to go to Adams. Don't know if he can handle this or not. Nope. Intercepted. Uh, just perfect defense. All around. Left tackle got blown up. Or, oh, no, my halfback got blown up. And at this point, I was fixing to get sacked. So just all kinds of bad. So that entire interception was all for naught. A complete waste. So we got to punt it back. Hopefully he'll fair catch that. Could have had probably a touchdown. Avila would have made the catch, but he dropped it. Our best receiver. So they run a lot of two tiny end sets. They've shown a little bit of everything so far. Pretty much the power shoot offense. At least the formations. Pick up an easy five yards there. Do something like this. Get a stop right there. Get a stop. Stop it. Stop it. Took, takes three hits to get him down. Third and five. I don't think they're going to get this playoff, but we're going to go cloud. They may just run the ball. They're going with a bigger set, so this probably wasn't a good idea to do something like that. Going with the toss, but we'll take it. That's fine. So we're going to get the ball back. And that's the end of the first quarter. We are tied. Frankly, I'm okay with that. <laughs> For as bad as that went. That be tied with these guys. That's a good thing. So let's get back to the run game. Get a block right there. Okay, so we are on the left hash. Let's go with dive. Did they run a 4 3 or a 3 4? They're going nickel, so I can't, still don't know yet. Good blocking right there. Good play right there for eight yards. That was a great play. Let's go back to a toss. Zone nickel. And again, I need to change this. I forgot. It's. My fort, not my uh, my audibles. I just forget to do this. I know we're going to change. We need this one. I just forget to fix them. They're going zone. They're doing. We'll go to the left. We're going to let that clock roll. She could tell our offensive line just isn't very good. Just get the first down. Just enough. Let's do a counter with Boyle. Every now and then we've been able to make the counter work. Now I think they're going man here. If the blocking's halfway decent, it's okay. You're just taking a chance with that guard who pulls so late. Get it down to a couple of seconds. 
nope. Couldn't block him. Now we're behind the chains. I'm going to go back, second and 13. I'm going to go back to our run. We'll go back to direct. At least we're doing every bit of that. We're going to go to the left. Let that clock roll. I, I don't normally like using direct a ton. But when you're behind the chains like this, I definitely don't mind doing it. Thankfully, that free safety came down wrong. He may score a touchdown. Oh, so close. Great run by Boyle. We need to get a touchdown here. We are on the one-yard line. That's what we're going to do. Let's go slam. We're going goal line, so I... Uh, going zone? We're going zone, so we're going to go this way. The clock has stopped, so we'll go ahead and snap it and get a touchdown. So we are up. We got our first lead of the day. We'll just stick with that run game as best we can, and we'll sprinkle in. I try to keep it, my passing as safe as possible for Schneider. He just We just need to execute a little bit better. Now, he's made better throws today than in the past. It's just always off and on with him, but, but he does need help from his receivers as well. But just in terms of production, this is one of the worst group of wide receivers I've ever had at this FBS level, or at the Power 5 level. We'll try to improve that with recruiting. Hopefully that starts today. Man, we need some bodies in the worst way. We got to win the day in order to get a couple. This is technically our most important game of the season, to be honest. Just for recruiting purposes. Get a win. Gets one step closer to a bowl game. The whole... I mean, just a lot of things are riding on this one. Going with a pass play. Somebody got to him. Good deal. Defensive tackle. Second and 13. Are they... I'll probably go quarters here. I think they may pass just because they're so behind the chains. So we'll, we'll go quarters. This is... Nope. Good stop right there, but they got a good gain. Third and three. I'm going to go man. They may just run the ball. Do something like let's do something like this. He didn't get it. He didn't get it. Fourth and inches. Oh my gosh! Punt the ball. Punt the ball. This is huge. We got to get the ball here. Go down the field and score a touchdown. Go up two scores. That would be amazing. Now somebody get a block on the left. Nope, ain't gonna happen. Face mask. Thank you. Hopefully it's a 15-yarder. Five-yarder. That's fine. I'm going to go back here. Let's go QB choice. I'm going to go off tackle with Dark. They're going man nickel. Just don't shift hard to the right. Ah. Face mask again. Thank you. Two in a row. Another five yarder. So, what hash are we on? We are on the left hash steel. Let's go back to fullback over. We're going man. That's good. The clock is going. I'm going to let it do so. We got all three timeouts. We're in really good shape here. We just need to execute. Score a touchdown right before half. Now, they're going to get the ball at the start of the third quarter, but that's okay. As long as we score a touchdown here before half, then we'll be good. Good defense. So, a second and four. Minute and a half. We can go back to cross up. At this point, I don't mind hurrying this up, so we're going to try that. 
throws this one out to the right. Kelly drops it. Hey, third and four. That was, that was tough. Let's do a direct. I'm going to run the ball. Not too excited about the chances on this one, but they're not shifting super hard. Get a block right there. Huge play. Let's call a timeout. We didn't get out of bounds. That should have been tackled. We should have got a tackle on the backfield, but that didn't happen, Think. Let's go offensive line. Oh, my gosh. What do we call? I'm still going to run the ball. I'm really... I'm trying to stay away from my passing game as best we can. They're blitzing on the... Okay, this is going to maybe work out. They're blitzing on the right, so we're going to go to the left. We can outrun this cat. Get out of bounds. Now we're on the 22. From here, we're going to go right here, and we're going to go P. Reed. We're going to go zone nickel. Now, Schneider, this is his worst throw. For whatever reason, he, he's like a Jared Garantano. He just can't make these little screen pass type uh, throws. We're going to go right here. A little bit better. Get out of bounds. Second and three. Now, I want to make sure I have that audible set up. I did set that up, didn't I? It, yes, it's square. We're going to go right here, and I'm going to run the ball. Please go man. We're going man. So we're going to go with square. We're going to go to spider 2 Y banana. Hopefully they are still in man, and they are. We're going to do that. We're going to go to our fullback if we can. Oh, you got to be kidding. Perfect execution, except he just... How do we have an impact quarterback that can't make this throw? I don't I don't understand it. He just struggles with it. Just these little short... I mean, he struggles with a lot of passes, I guess, or a lot of throws. All right. We're going to go tight end delay. 4-3. We're going to do something like that. We're going to look at on this one. Much better, Schneider. Good job. And we didn't get in somehow. But we're on the one-yard line. 57 seconds. Let's go back to slam. The clock has stopped. We're going to go to the right. That's my fault. That was a bad play. That's good defense, too. Let's go full back over. We're going zone, so got no choice but to do something like this. I'm going to let that clock roll. If this doesn't work, we'll go half back direct. Need to get a touchdown here. Need to get some points of some sort. I mean, I'll take a field goal, although I would much rather have a touchdown. There we go. Good deal. So we got our two-score lead. So we accomplished our goal. We took off the rest of the time in the second quarter. We got our touchdown. We're up two scores, and we're about to head into half. Now, there is, what, 26 seconds left? Let's try to survive these 26 seconds so nothing goofy happens. We'll kick our extra point. And he tacks down the extra point. Down to just a few seconds. Took up a minute 42. Took 10 plays to get there, but we got there. I would almost high kick this thing. But our kickoff defense has been spectacular today. Let's see if they can do the same thing here. There we go. Minute or 24 seconds. I'm assuming they're going to run the clock out. We'll go with basic cover two man. Do something like this. Toss play. He's got blocking here. Ooh, I, he almost outran me. That was close. <laughs> but that was a good stop. So that should be the last play of the game. They, I wouldn't think they would snap it here. I don't think they're going to. Okay, that is end of the first half. We are up 21-7. to A disastrous first part of the first quarter, but we overcame it. You go to stats, 205 yards, they're, they're 99. Three, their passing game is going good, but the run game not so much. So our defense is doing a really good job. Our 
third downs are looking good. The turnovers, they're one apiece. In terms of penalty yards, about negligible at this point. It's just been nothing but face masks. Schneider, 4 of 9, 79 yards, 0 touchdowns, and the 1 interception at first play of the game. Running the ball, we have kept it pretty even, 6, 6, and 5 for the big 3. But Boyle had the really big run, but look at that. Every single one of them's got a touchdown so far, which is always cool to see. For saving, there's nothing to see there. Defensively, pretty hodgepodge. Everybody's kind of doing their thing on the tackle front. Camaro is 3 tackles for loss. He also has a sack. So he's been really killing it today at defensive tackle so far. All right, let's get back into it. They're going to get the ball started in the third quarter. Decent kick. It will be returned. Uh-oh, uh-oh. Oh, my gosh, we saved a touchdown. <laughs> Go back and look at this. I mean, this was going to be six points right here. Good blocking. But he pushed me the wrong way. Oh my gosh, how lucky can he get? All right, let's go back to man. We're doing a good job stopping their run game. Doing a whole lot better job than we did against Florida State. Another toss. You can have those any day of the week. The biggest reason why that play doesn't work well is because the defense is triggered as soon as the ball is pitched in that play. Just for whatever reason, that's just the way it's set up. Intercept that. Slightly overthrew it for interference. Maybe that's why he was so wide open? Either way, that's a big play for them. I'm going to stay in man. Again, I, I don't want this running back to run all over us. Just don't run to the left. I probably should have kept it as is. Something. Halfback draw. Uh-oh. Here he comes. Here he comes. Oh, no. Somebody stop it. Good old halfback draw from the gun. Works good for them. Never for me. Let's go back to man. They're going ace twins. Wait for it. Goes with the ace set here. Play action, wide open. That's a good man beater route right there. But it's not all that great against zone. That's why I don't use that much. Second one, so we'll just go back to man. So far, they're not having any issues on this drive. Of course, we were giving them a little help on the penalties. Pick up the first down. If you can continue to pick up small chunks of yards like that, you can really start to wear a defense down. I would get the crowd all excited, but we don't have much of a crowd to do that. Wake Forest lines up for the shotgun set. Back to pass. Intercept that. We'll take it. They didn't get a yard. I probably got a, a loss of a yard. Nope, it's still second and ten. Going back to a really big set. Do something like this. Play action. Ah, oh, he's wide open. He didn't get the first, I don't think. Their quarterback's playing great. 30 inches. We'll bring everybody up. Do something like this. Touchdown. Nope. I thought he had a clear lane right there. So another easy first down. This is what they should have been doing all along. Give him the ball. He's your best player. If I had an impact running back, he'd be getting the ball about 30 times a game. That's a touchdown. Ooh, good open field tackle. Surprised he was sitting there waiting on it. We're going goal line on this one. Fullback dive. Ah. So that was the easiest drive ever. Of course, like I said, we gave them a little help. Thankfully, we're still up a touchdown, but we're going to need to get that touchdown back. And 
That's what that offense needs to be doing. Just give him, him the ball over and over again. Then we'll play action off of it. Their quarterback is, what, 7 for 7 on the day? Let's see if Wright can do something here. No blocking. Thank you. So we are on the right hash. We can try another toss play. They're going man nickel. Man dime. Sorry, they got one guy blitzing over there. What worries me a little bit is the spread of the line. Bubble. Shoot. Perfect defense. Somebody came through and just destroyed my right guard. I don't know what happened there. You can go back and look at this. Perfect execution. Linebacker blitz right there. We're very fortunate we didn't fumble it. Let's go deep cross up. We'd love to make that up a little bit. We've had decent success with this play today. It's been off and on. Of course, we threw a pick that first one, then completed what one, and maybe just one. I don't remember. Hope we get a completion here. Good throw. Right where it needed to be. Just don't fumble it. Great job, Schneider. Good job. Okay, we are here. Let's go. Let's do a counter with Dargan. We're going. They must be a 4 3 team. I could have sworn out there with 3 4. I guess not. The clock is rolling. We're going to let it do so. I need to run play action off this. There's one decent play action play in this formation that's pretty good. It's not the best, though. Good blocking there. Just face mask. Thank you. Another one. Five yarder. There may be an automatic first down. Well, it's going to be first down anyways, but first and one. Where are we? We're on the. We're still on the right hash. Let's go slam. With Boyle, they're going zone four three. Ooh, what happens if I do this? Bring him over. Does he just stay put? Let's go to the left or not. Wasn't expecting him to blitz, but he did. So second and three. We're going back to boy. We're going back to direct. Man, but they're going to blitz everybody here, aren't they? This ain't going to work. We're going to get ramshotted on this one. I moved this guy over, and that guy's still going to blitz. So we're going to just call a timeout. It's not going to work. So second and three. I'm going to go change something else. Go tight end delay. And we're going zone. This ain't. Not feeling good about this one. Well, hopefully we can execute. First down. Just enough. Get the first. Uh, let's see. Where are we at? Uh, let's do another toss, I guess. I'm just trying to think of what we can do. Blitzing on the right side. Please don't blitz on the other side. And this ain't going to work again. Dang it, dang it, dang it. I'm not going to go to the linebacker side. Perfect defense, and we're very fortunate they didn't get the ball there. Second and 11. Let's go fullback over. We're going zone, so I don't know how well this is going to work. The clock has stopped. We didn't get the first, though. Third and one. That's okay. Still doable. Let's go P.A. Reed. We're going man. 4-3 on this one. Clock is... Ah, you got to be kidding. We got lucky on this one. <laughs> so they play perfect defense. Look at these guys. They went spy with their defensive ends. So I was going to get stopped right there, so I had to go all the way to the other side. I'm waiting for my tight end to block somebody, and he still couldn't do it. So we get a first down there, somehow, some way. And 
incredible. So let's go, let's run slam. We're going zone 4-3. The clock has stopped. We'll go to the right. Good blocking there. Six points. Good deal. Good juke by Dargan. Good to see him get in the end zone again. I feel like he's been our third guy the entire season, but just kind of the way it's worked out. But, I mean, we're giving even ramps to all three. But it's good to see him get in the end zone. So we got the touchdown back. So we accomplished our goal. We're now back up two scores. Let's get back on defense and try to stop them. It's going to be tough if they keep running the ball. Get an extra point here. Two minutes and 24 seconds. Nine plays, 81 yards. That's a good stat line right there for what we're trying to do in our current situation. Let's kick an extra or a kickoff. We have done our extra point. Now they're returning this one. Good stop. So we're going to go back to man. Let's see if we can just play good sound defense. Going ace twins out of the gun. Going to pass. Get a stop. Uh oh, uh oh. Uh oh, uh oh. Oh my. Well, he got a touchdown off a screen. I didn't do my job on the back end, but nobody else did their job either. I'm not even going to look at it. I'm going to get upset. So just like that, they got their touchdown. You know how hard it is to score a touchdown from a screen play against man? But everything just had to work perfectly there for that to happen. Again, I don't want to look at it. So let's go back. Let's get back on offense. Didn't even give our offense a breather. Let's see if Wright can do something here. We've struggled. Somebody block for us. Ah, just don't fumble it. Decent return. And we're heading to the fourth quarter. We're up a touchdown. Can we somehow, some way, win this thing? We're going zone nickel. I'm going to go to the left. Good play there. Pick up what nine? I don't think we got the first. We're in the middle of the field. Let's take advantage of it. We're going zone. The clock is running. We're going to run as much clock as we can. I'd feel a whole lot more comfortable if we would get one more touchdown. But their offense is playing great, apparently. Just all of a sudden, the second half, they've really just kicked it up an extra gear. Decent blocking. Good throw. That wasn't smart. I was hoping he could juke around him. Thankfully, he didn't fumble it. So good for Tally. Let's go QB choice. We're going to do an off tackle with Dargan. We're going man on this one. I'm going to leave it as he is. The clock is running. I could bring somebody over. Nope, they're going zone, apparently. I thought they was going man. Guess not. Just no blocking. Good defense. So we're in the middle of the field. Let's go back to fullback over. We're going man nickel. What I want to do, we're going to flip it just to get away from that linebacker. They should stay in man. We're going to bring this guy over. Give us more field to play with. And let's see if we can get decent blocking on the left. The clock's still going. Go ahead and snap it. Pick up a first down. A good run there. Let's run counter. I think they're going man here. The clock has stopped, so we can go ahead and snap this thing. Good blocking. Just don't fumble it. Weird, interesting blocking situation. Normally you don't see this, but our tight end got pushed back so much and he had to block from there that we had to come through here. That's super rare for that to happen in this game, but there it is. We're on the five. 
Let's go with direct. Yeah, they're still going goal line, but at least Shotgun formation. we can do something like this. I hope that tight end can block that linebacker. We're going to let that clock roll, though. Get down to a few seconds. Nobody is blocking that impact guy. Just dive. I'm not going to let him force a fumble. It's not worth it. So it is what? Third and eight. What do you call here in this situation? I'm going to go back to pull back over. So I hope that made sense what I've done right there. If I would have tried to juke or done something right there, I think he would have forced a fumble. I'm like, nope, I'm just going to dive. I'm not going to let you make a play. So I think they're going zone here. We may just have to take the field goal and be done. Nope, they're going man. Ooh, and somebody moved. False start. So it's third and what? Something. Third and 13. Let's just do a toss play with Drummer. They're going man at least. Man dime. We're doing that. Let's do something like this. Oh my gosh. Don't, don't. Look at what happened to my quarterback. He got stuck on the center. He got stuck. How lucky can you get that somehow we did not fumble it there? That could have been an ultimate disaster. Shoo! Fourth and ten, let's kick a field goal. Hopefully we can make this. It's short. So it doesn't have a whole lot of time to do anything really goofy unless I just really mess it up. We're going to do something like this. Something like that. Let that clock roll a little bit. Get it down to about four seconds. Or three. Oh, I missed it! I missed it! Oh my gosh! Oh, I hate kicking an 06. It's awful. And just like that, they're in it. All it would have took is that field goal, and we'd have won this thing. Let's let's not panic. Let's see if we can finish it, anyways. Man, I just missed it. I, I hit the button too early. And just like that, a huge gain. Just like that, all of a sudden, they're at midfield. And here they come. They're going to call something goofy here. Play action. Intercept that. Overshot it. Second and ten. Looks like they are dead set on passing, so let's go quarters. Man, that's just my fault. I just didn't execute on that kick. It happens. Good open field tackle. Now, they're going to hurry at this thing up. Ooh, they're not going to. We're going to go cloud. Now, this is two-down territory anyways. Of course, they have to convert in order to win this or to have a chance. Play action. Big play. Just didn't execute. Safety just messed it up. And just like that, they're fixing the score. Ah, uh, just nothing you can do about it. They're just making plays, and we're not right at the moment. So Dargan ends up winning player of the game, yet he didn't do a ton, but he got the two touchdowns. Look at that. Their quarterback is just excellent. He's just making plays. Oh, my gosh. Ow, just messed up on the field goal. That's one of the reasons why a lot of people don't want to play Heisman in this game. Stop him! Stop him! Broke 14 tackles. Of course, he gets the first. I kind of wish they'd score her quickly. Let's go man, I guess. They're, now they're thinking about running it. Yeah, now they call a timeout. Let's go back to quarters. Somebody make a play out there. Anybody. Hey, it happened again. I think he's popping up. I don't know what that is. Get him, get him, get him. Huge play right there. Sack. And they called another timeout. Second and 14. Let's go back to quarters. Again, they've run nothing but 12 personnel all day. That's all they got in their playbook. He 
Intercept it. Huge, huge, huge. Take it to the house. Six points. Game over. Game over. Play of the season. Play of the season. Play of the year. Wow. Impact players making plays out there. Incredible. Play of the year. That's just a turning point of our dynasty right there. Man, we needed that in the worst way. Oh, my gosh. Well, I know what thumbnail I'm going to use. Oh, just like that, we're probably going to win it. Now, crazy things have happened. Crazy year things. So what I'm going to do, I'm not going to give them an easy touchdown. So we're going to high kick it on this next one. I am not going to let them have an easy return. So we will high kick this thing. Something like this. I'm just not going to take the chance. It's not worth it. Oh, and he decides to return that. That was smart. Tereshinsky, I wonder if he's related to the quarterback, Tereshinsky, who played at Georgia, who's in this game, by the way. They're probably brothers or cousins or something. I can't imagine Tereshinsky being a quite of a popular name. Somebody with Georgia history can probably, or Wake Forest history can let me know on that one. Sack. Huge. And he's hurt. Now, their backup is just as good. And just like that, this game is over with. We've just turned the tide all together. Let's go back to quarters. Oh, my gosh. What a game. Make sure you stay to the end of the video to see if we get any commitments. We need a couple. We need somebody to commit. He's wide open over there against quarters. Ow, 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 ow. I should have just let that one go. I should have stayed with my safety. I'll do that going forward. That was my fault 100%. He's wide open again over there. 11 seconds. They're going back to that. He's wide open over there on the far right. That quarters, it's, it's not bulletproof. Uh, somebody get him. Ah, dang it. So now it's five seconds. And I, I guess he didn't get out of bounds again. <laughs> And game over. There we go. Final score, 35 to 21. That was by far the most entertaining game of the season. Just a lot of back and forth and such. But man, huge win. Our by far our biggest game of the season, and we got the victory. So let's go check out some stats. Then we'll see if we get a commitment or two. Let's go to stance. 353 yards to our 345. So their offense played better than ours in general. Although we didn't turn the ball over as much. But we they gave up three sacks. They done a whole lot better job on third down towards the end. Turnovers. Play of the season. We all know which one we're talking about. And you look here. Uh, penalties, three apiece. All of them was face mask from what I remember. Except for one uh, pass interference. Then you look at our individual stats, 7 to 12, 160 yards, no touchdowns, and interception for Schneider. I think he threw the ball a little bit better. I think he had better throws than worse throws overall. He still had some couple stinkers, but he done okay. Running the ball, Boyle with 91 yards, Drummer with 67, Dargan with 37. Each one got at least one touchdown. Receiving, it was all tally. All four of those catches were deep cross up. That's the only thing we can kind of get going at the moment. And it's not him. It's just the execution. It's just the play itself. These other ones, again, Elliott, he should have been on the stat sheet, but he dropped an obvious cover zero beater. But that's just, you know, that's just on him. We had nobody. We ran the ball so much today, we didn't have one guy get a pancake or anything. That's weird. Defensively, Davis and Dewan led in tackles. Tackles for loss, Camaro, Sacks, Alexander had two of them. And we had one interception by Dewan. Dewan... Impact guy. He made a big place today, which is huge. Okay, let's get out of here. And will you look at that? We got our first commitments of the dynasty. Philip Warren finally decided to commit. Tackle at a North Carolina local kid. Then we, uh, again, I want to make Tennessee a pipeline state since it's close. It's a border state. And they produce some decent talent. And, of course, I'm from Tennessee. But we got a commitment from a center, Kobe Lacey. So we are locking up our offensive line, trying to make it a little bit better. So with that being said, let's go into recruiting. 
And we're now down to these two guys. We're going to put 50 on the free safety and 50 on the middle linebacker who will be visiting in the next home game. Now, you, we can go straight to this guy, Harris. Again, we know what he likes is academics. So we're going to go here, and we're going to have him come for the Navy game. And Harper visited today, but he did not commit. But we're putting 50 points on the guy. Maybe that'll be enough, but we need to continue to win. Okay, let's go and check out the scores for last or for this week. And of course, we beat Wake Forest, but they weren't ranked. So starting off, Boston College beats Virginia Tech, Tennessee over South Carolina, Florida over Georgia, Texas over Oklahoma State. Then you have Nebraska destroying Oklahoma. Those were the days. Florida State over Maryland, UTEP over Rice, Auburn over Ole Miss. UCLA over Stanford, Texas Tech over Baylor, Michigan State over Indiana, Toledo over Central Michigan. Then you have USC over Washington State, Oregon State over Arizona, Kansas State over Colorado, Penn State over Purdue. Then you have Minnesota, again, uh, Ohio State beating Minnesota. Then Miami over North Carolina. And last but not least, BYU over Air Force. So come on back. In our next game, we have... Clemson. Another tough one. It's we're playing at Clemson. Looks like their defense in a couple spots is pretty good. Their offense is terrible. Maybe we can get a win here, but they're they're five and three. They're doing something right. So come on back. We'll take on the Tigers, and I'll talk to you later.